This is Dale Roberts, and you've tuned in to One Jack Monkey. One hundred days to one hundred pull-ups. That's exactly my goal, and I'm about uh, nineteen or twenty days deep into this, so I think it's just uh, it's justifiable to go ahead and start posting up a video so I can be able to share my uh, thoughts through voice as opposed to through uh, literature as I normally do. So uh, really, my thoughts are this: uh, I've always been very intrigued by the number one hundred because, of course, it it kind of infers to me that uh, the perfection that 100% value, if you will, uh, where something is almost flawless, almost complete, if you will. Uh, not to say, though, that we can't go beyond 100, but at this point, one of my favorite exercises is pull-ups, next to squats and uh, push-ups. But uh, all that to say this, I've always been intrigued to be able to do 100 pull-ups, but I have not been able to accomplish that. Been able to do about 35 straight um, and uh, for the most part lately I've been able to do is about 10 pull-ups uh, up until about a few weeks ago when I started this program that is and as I'm really putting more priority on this I'm starting to focus a bit more obviously on what can I do to get to this goal now that's not to say that I should every single day go into the gym with the intent of doing nothing but pull-ups because that's just insane uh, I will eventually hurt myself, uh, I might get discouraged, so what I'm going to do is focus a bit more on secondary type movements, uh, things that are going to incorporate a lot of these pulling muscles that's going to get my body straight up. Now I must say right ahead of time that I don't do kipping pull-ups. Uh, I'm not a big fan of them, not to say that there's no value in that, Lord knows uh, I met a retired Marine Corps officer one point that you know he could do hundreds of them at a time when he was in uh, basic training and you know he said kipping was a huge thing now for those of you that are familiar with kipping kipping is essentially using your lower body to kind of propel yourself up into the full pull-up position me I like to just kind of hang and just pull my full body weight literally like leaving the bottom half of your body almost like it's uh, completely useless so um, with that being said, today I just kind of focused one of my secondary movements. One of the movements that's going to help me get to my ultimate goal was uh, doing some pull downs. And I got on some cable equipment and I pretty much focused on pulling on the cable equipment half my body weight. So that was right, actually, right about 90 pounds, if I can recall it right off the top of my head. I did about 34 reps for one set and then two other sets of 33 repetitions a piece with two minutes rest in between each one of those. That's all I focused on today. Since it's a secondary priority day, I'm not too focused on trying to just absolutely crush my back and my biceps just so I can be able to get my pull-up goal because every Saturday is when I'm going to put my body to the test. That's when I'm really going to do that, my primary pull-up day. So uh, stay tuned. Uh, I wanted to keep this as brief as possible. I think going forward we'll probably have a lot more shorter videos so I can be able to share exactly what I'm doing. I'll share some pictures. Um, for the most part, if you're following me on uh, the blog spot, I'll go ahead and I'll put a link in, uh, uh, link in the description below. Sometimes it doesn't go right to it, so just copy, paste, put it in your URL. I'm sorry, I'm not tech savvy, nor do I really want to feel like hiring somebody to do that. So there you go. 100 pull-ups, 100 days, stay with me over for the next 80 days, watch me do it.